Alright, what is going on guys, it's Taz here, and welcome back to the channel. Now today what we've got for you guys is something a bit different here on the channel. With Comic Con happening right now, and so many trailers dropping, I decided that it would be beneficial not only to me, but to you guys the viewers as well, to do a sort of reaction slash breakdown style for all of these Comic Con trailers that interest me. So this will just allow me to get the content out to you guys a bit quicker, and you will get more of a genuine first impression from me as well. So what I'm going to do is first react to the trailer as I watch it for the first time, then when it's all done I will scrub through the trailer and break it down, picking out any of the major points or easter eggs I notice. And this is all going to be live and more or less one take, so all natural, all ums, uhs, and buts, and awkward pauses included, so if this goes well then I may make it a regular thing for new trailers whenever they come out for movies and shows. Without any further ado guys, let's get into the reaction. Alright guys, so the first trailer to come out today is the Titans trailer. This came out at around 6am for San Diego Comic Con, so let's get into this. This is going to be a very interesting trailer, I'm very excited for this show, and yeah, let's just get into it, so scroll over to it. 3, 2, 1, let's go. Trailers for TV, okay. Flying Grayson service, maybe? Raven? Okay, Flying Grayson's cool. Everything led me here. Raven? To you. You're the boy from the circus. Alright, so Dick Grayson's a cop now. Flying Grayson's flashback, not surprising. Robin throwing star? That's pretty awesome. <laughs> Who's up there? Please. It's Batman. Can you help? No, sir. Where's Batman? <laughs> oh god. Oh shoot, okay. Something evil inside of me. Raven's looking pretty cool too. But you can control it. Hey, Beast Boy's green. Alright, Starfire. Okay. Starfire's orange, that's good. You don't know what I've become. Ooh, hawk and dove. Sometimes when I feel the darkness, it feels good. This looks crazy. My mom says there's no such thing as monsters. I used to think that. I was wrong. Oh man, that's crazy. The effects. Okay. All right. I'm into it. That looks awesome. That looks amazing. That is everything I wanted from this trailer. You get to see everybody. Okay. Yep. All right. Let's just stop it here. That's that's awesome. So what I want to do now is just kind of go back through the trailer, scroll through it a little bit, and then just sort of tell you guys the things that I've picked out and some little things that I notice here or there. So let's scroll back through this trailer and give it a second look over. Alright, so giving it a second look over, first obviously you can see that it is going to be a very hardcore show, um, not suitable for viewers under 18, so it's a, it's a pretty hardcore show, so let's scroll through it, and that trailer did look pretty hardcore, so we see uh, Raven, it looks like going into the Flying Grayson Circus, uh, possibly real, possibly like a vision or something, so Raven's walking in there looking for... Obviously looking for Robin, Flying Grayson's, uh, and then we see Raven in the police station with Dick Grayson as a cop, as it was sort of, you know, uh, not leaked out, but as it was said, so he will be a cop in the show, so that's going to be a pretty interesting storyline, so we get to see a better look at Raven, better look at Dick Grayson as sort of detective uh, Grayson, I guess you could say, and then a flashback to the Flying Grayson circus and the sort of whole fall that started all, uh, fall that started it all, I guess you could say. Um, and then, so let's move on a little bit more, and we see Robin, I guess, in his, uh, like his apartment or his loft or whatever you want to call it, and then he's got the Robin throwing star batarang type of thing, and that is awesome. I saw a picture of that yesterday, I think. I don't know, it was at some sort of thing at Comic-Con, but look at that throwing star. That just looks awesome. This show just looks amazing. Okay, let's continue. Um, so what do we see now? We see some guys in an alleyway, 
And then they're looking up. Who is it? Is it Batman? I don't know who's up there. So we scroll a bit more, get a bit more of Raven talking to uh, Dick Grayson again. And then there we go. We see Robin drop onto the car. They turn around. Where's Batman? And <laughs> let's let's play this again. It's just hard. Oh man, <laughs> F Batman. Yep, that's uh, <laughs> that's pretty hardcore. So we see, you know, Robin taking out these guys. Just super hardcore. I assume he's still not killing, but you know. You would never think that you would see a DC show where Robin literally stares at a criminal and says, F Batman. That's, that's ridiculous. This show is going to be insane. So this fall, we see Raven again going kind of all demonic, demon-y. So that's going to be pretty cool. We get to see Beast Boy finally. This was sort of a big question was whether or not Beast Boy is actually going to be green because of all those behind the scenes pictures where we saw them all in their street clothes and everything and Beast Boy wasn't green so maybe that's just an effect or it looks pretty normal so it's most likely just that's just how he is on the streets and there's still going to be a big question as to how his powers are exactly going to work so maybe they could work kind of like Vixen or hopefully fingers crossed they work like they do uh, in the comics and the other animated shows and stuff so let's scroll on a little bit more we get to actually see our first full look at starfire she's still wearing that outfit that she was wearing in those leaked pictures um but we do get to see that she actually does kind of glow orange and everything so that's going to be very cool to see uh, i wonder if we're actually going to get a more comic book accurate version of the starfire costume or if that's just all we're going to see at the beginning so i don't 100 percent know but starfire does look very cool i really like that kind of glowy effect i think that's probably the best way that they could have done it rather than to just make her 100 percent orange all the time so that looks very cool as well so let's scroll on a little bit more get some more dick grayson get some of robin hitting a dude with his staff then we see a uh, hawk and dove and it looks like a warehouse uh hawk is kind of captured dove is slicing this dude with her wings which looks awesome uh hawks there as well i don't know who's that supposed to be i have absolutely no clue somebody with a knife um let's continue this dude is super bloody yeah this show is <laughs> going to be super intense um beating a guy with a bat Alrighty then let's continue um <laughs> get to see uh raven and dick grayson yet again um, and Raven, it seems like Raven is going to be a huge focus of this. It just seems like her struggling with like her powers and coming to terms with who she actually is and everything. That seems like that's going to play a pretty big part within at least this first season, most likely possibly leading to a sort of Trigon arc, maybe at the end of the season or for season two, uh, that would be very cool as well. Again, we get a nice little look at all of our characters again. We get Robin here suited up. We get another look at Starfire again, see with the glowing green eyes and everything. So that's going to look uh, pretty awesome, I think. So scrolling some more, um, another shot of Dove. And oh my gosh, geez, there's so much blood in this trailer. It's, just, uh, it's awesome. Um, so we get to see some more awesome fights. We get another shadowy shot of Beast Boy. Um, very excited to see how Beast Boy actually does work within the show. Uh, some more demonic raven, some people falling. <laughs> um, what else? Scroll through. Raven in the car, talking to Dick Grayson, and, you know, Raven's just demonic now, so... And then, you know, it breaks to the Titans logo. So, this just looks awesome. Titans... This is going to be an amazing show. This is the show that I was excited for the most for DC Universe. This is the show that, you know, I just I want to get DC Universe specifically for the show. And it has actually come out how much DC Universe is going to be. I'm just going to add that in here real quick. It's going to be, I think, eight bucks a month. So that's not too bad. And if you sign up now, you get to buy it for a year and you get an additional three months on top of that. So that's a nice little deal with that. If you guys do want to go actually pre-order the DC Universe streaming service, I will leave it linked down in the description if you want to go buy it and check it out. As well as I will be linking this full trailer if you just want to go watch it uh, without my comments 
commentary over it. So other than that guys, this trailer just looks absolutely amazing. It's pretty much everything that I wanted from it. It's just you get to see the hardcore action, you get to see all of these characters and kind of where they are, uh, I guess when the show is going to pick up and it just like going once over it again it just it just looks like it's gonna be amazing i can't get over the fact that robin's just taking dudes out and just says f batman straight up so that's that's gonna be pretty insane so other than that guys i want to know your thoughts on this trailer down in the comments below are you excited for titans does this trailer get you even more hyped for titans than you already were i want to know your thoughts on all of this down in the comments below so i will be trying to do this for more comic-con trailers so get hyped for that as well but until next time, guys, it's been Taz, and I'll see you guys in the next video.